gas has neither a definite shape nor a definite volume a molecule are far apart in gases the intermolecular space is very large and the intermolecular force of attraction is very weak or negligible the molecule is free to move in all directions they occupy all available spaces thus gases are not rigid and are highly compressible some examples of gases are air water vapor etc difference between solids liquids and gas shape solid has definite shape liquid no definite shape it takes the shape of the container in which it is kept gas no definite shape volume solid have definite volume liquid too have a definite volume gas no definite volume it occupies all available spaces arrangement of molecules molecules are tightly packed and closely packed molecules are loosely packed in liquids molecules are far apart in gases intermolecular space the intermolecular space is almost negligible in solid it is larger than solids in liquid and gases have very large intermolecular space intermolecular force of attraction very strong in solids and weak in liquids and weakest in gas position of molecules the position of molecules fixed they will only vibrate about their mean position the position of the molecules is not fixed the position of the molecules is not fixed in gases they are free to move in all directions rigidity the solids are rigid and liquids are not rigid and gas is also not rigid compressibility solid is incompressible as liquid slightly compressible and so gases are highly compressible fluidity solid do not flow liquid it flows from higher level to the lower level gases it flows in all directions so thank you friends see you tomorrow part 5 bye